Hey guys, what's going on? So I uh, figured I'd try, to, we're at a property here. Figured I'd try the GoPro. So I just pulled up at this property and my guy came back to me and he said, hey, uh, our mower fell through the trailer. And I'm thinking he's messing with me, right? I'm like, what? He said, yeah, our mower fell through the trailer and it was actually that 36 over there. And it completely caved in and went through the trailer. And uh, I must have driven that for a couple miles because the last yard wasn't that far. So let me show you. Should have recorded it before I took it out because it was a bit of a challenge. There it is. Uh, that's piece right there. So. Uh, not good. Not good at all. So I'm going to have to rearrange somehow for the parking. Maybe put the 48 over here and the 36 over there. Because this is not going to work. So the tire was all the way in there and it was crooked completely. Like, I mean, it was down. And, uh, so you wonder how that happens. Well, I rented an aerator a few years back and the plugs dropped when I hit a bump and it created a little hole. You know what? I take that back guys, because that's what the aerator did right there, right here. So this is not from the aerator. This had to just been weak wood that over time just caved in, I'm assuming. I'm not sure. But, uh, anyway, I'm sure you guys can tell by my voice I'm not happy right now. But it's not, I'm, I'm glad I didn't like damage the mower or do any kind of damage, you know, to anything else. Yeah, the tire looks fine. This whole, this whole tire, guys, was like down on in there. <laughs> yeah, so when my guy came in and said, our mower went through the trailer. I'm like, what? <laughs> anyway, it's kind of upsetting and it's, uh, but it is what it is. I've had this trailer now since 2010, 11, 10, I think 2010. Yeah, maybe 11. Anyway, one, 10 or 11. So that's tells you right there. It's, it's, <laughs> it's gone through some stuff and uh, I guess while I'm here real quickly this is the front this is actually a super small yard this is the front right there and that's the back So of course fence line all the way around, just a quick little mow, it's really not a big yard at all. So anyway, I better get back to mowing, but uh, man, you know, um, I am glad that that happened to the 36 and not like the 61. Could you imagine the 61, one tire all the way down on the ground? talk about trying to get that bad boy out the 36 I was able to just actually lift by my by hand <coughs> well what I did I had one of my guys lift it by hand or, <sighs> while I just hit, hit it in reverse and you know that way that till the tire got the grip <sighs> so uh, I'm going to go ahead and get this yard done and figure out what the hell am I going to do if I'm going to park it the same way, just maybe push it more forward, or if I'm going to try to get it on the opposite side. Most likely I'm going to do the opposite side and put the 48 on that side because it's wider. And uh, I got to get this fixed, guys. I got to get this fixed ASAP. Probably get a piece of, new piece of wood in there ASAP because... Uh, 
you know i i can't i can't be driving my trailer with freaking holes in it so uh i don't know it's it's here i am guys it's uh it's getting kind of warm in here. It's it's quite quite depressing, and I don't know what happened. I guess I must have hit a bump. Um, trying to use the mirror, guys, so I can see myself. I guess I must have hit a bump, and when I hit a bump, that that was a weak spot in the wood, and it just went right through. So. Um, these are the things that we deal with out here with lawn care. All you lawn care people out there, you 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 know you know guys, you know what we're dealing with. Um, but maybe some people who are thinking about getting in lawn care or <coughs> you know are just starting out, just be prepared. I mean, and always have a backup of something. Whether it's mowers, whether it's tires, whether it's a jack, just always have things ready. Because you just don't know what you'll encounter. I mean, as you guys can see, you know, I had a great Sunday with my wife. We hung out, took it easy, and then right here, started the week Monday. Look, bam. Piece of dirt. You know, um, sorry. And then bam, you know, there it is. And now I'm I'm gonna have to try to get this fixed ASAP. Um, and if I don't get to it by either this afternoon or tomorrow, that means I'm gonna have to work around it till it's some one day this week where I can get to it. So it's 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 just I don't know. Anyway, I want to make this quick video show you guys the things that we go through in lawn care. This is it just literally occurred, and the minute I pulled up. My guy jumped out to grab the weed eater. He went out to open the gate for me and he came back and he's like, knocked on the window and he's like, hey, our mower has fallen through the trailer. Like, what? I'm like, that makes no sense, what? He's like, no, our mower fell through the trailer. So, all right, I will keep you guys posted. I'll, I'll keep you guys posted on that and how I fix it and uh, maybe make another little clip about how um, how I uh, rearranged the uh, the mowers in there to finish off the day. So, all right, talk to you later, guys.